Yo, what's up guys, Complies here. So in today's video, I'm gonna be going over a setting that a lot of people already know about. And what this setting is gonna do is it's gonna brighten your game up a ton and just make it more visually appealing to look at. Now, I don't know about you guys, but when I play a game with really bad colors, I just kind of end up getting bored and I tend to lose interest pretty quickly. That's why games like Fortnite and Overwatch have captured my attention so much because they're so bright and colorful. And Apex by default has pretty bad colors when you compare it to other games. But before we get into this video really quickly, I just wanna remind you guys that all the links to my social medias are in the description below. I'm the most active on Twitter, so follow that to stay up to date with me. I also have a TikTok and Instagram where I post my clips. We have a growing Discord. We're almost at a thousand members, so if you're looking for people to play with or you have any questions at all, feel free to join that. And also, don't forget to follow my Twitch where I stream just about every other day. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe on this video if you enjoy it. But anyways, guys, that's it for that. Now let's get right into the video. Now the setting that we're going to be going over is the colorblind settings. If you watch a lot of different Apex players, you'll notice that their reticle isn't red like the default. It's yellow, or it's like this wash out pink. Now these settings are implemented for people who are actually colorblind, but there are a couple of them that will brighten up the game and make it look a lot more colorful. And real quick, I'm going to be going over those with you guys. So let's just go into our settings, go over to the gameplay tab, scroll down a little bit, and in accessibility, you'll find a setting called colorblind mode. Now this is what the default one looks like. You'll notice you have a red reticle. The armors aren't too shiny. It's just pretty basic. It's what we're used to. It's the default, but I'm going to go ahead and turn on Tritonopia and let you guys see the difference real quick. You'll notice that the colors are a lot more vibrant. The armor is going to pop a lot more, which is going to catch your eye and allow you to see it a little bit easier. You also have this yellow reticle that a lot of people like, and personally, I think I like a little bit more myself. Since a lot of the enemies in this game are pretty dark, the red can sometimes blend into them and the background, so this yellow is just a nice contrast. So if you guys are looking to get the best colors out of your game, you're going to want to use the Tritonopia setting in your colorblind mode. Another decent one that you can use is the Protonopia setting. It's similar to Tritonopia in that it gives you that yellow reticle, but it's going to make the colors of the armor a lot more muted. So yeah, you can use this if you want, but I much prefer Tritonopia as it makes the game a lot more vibrant. So real quick, if you didn't catch it the first time, I'm going to show you guys how to turn it on. So we're just going to go into our settings, go to the gameplay tab, scroll down to the bottom to accessibility, and in our colorblind mode, yours will most likely be on off. Go ahead and go to the one all the way to the right and turn it on Tritonopia. And boom, the game just looks so much better like this. And in the description below, I will leave a link to my video where I go over a few more settings to help your game look a lot better. And I will most likely be redoing this video in the future as I found just a couple of more things to add on to it that weren't in the original video. But yeah, if you're looking to get the most out of your game and make it look amazing, make it look very colorful, you want to check out that video. I'll leave it linked in the description below. Now, I'm sorry this video wasn't a full guide or anything, guys. I've been pretty busy IRL. Me and my girlfriend just bought a house, so we've spent the last week and a half moving in. Work has been crazy too. I'm sure a lot of you guys can relate to that. And unfortunately, guides just take so much time to make, which just isn't in the cards for me right now, guys. So I hope you guys don't really mind these single tips and tricks videos. I was also planning on throwing a montage in here, but my shadow play turned off on its own. So I was playing for about two and a half weeks thinking I was saving my clips, when in reality, shadow play was just never on the entire time. So that bummed me out pretty bad. So instead of a little montage or some nice clips, I'll just be doing some nice gameplay videos. So that's going to be the end of the tips part of this video. Like I said, the next is going to be just some gameplay that I got from my Twitch, where we are just absolutely popping off and duo trios all night long. Remember to leave a like and a comment, and don't forget to subscribe if you enjoyed this video. And like I said earlier, all the links to my social medias are in the description below. And don't forget, guys, please be sure to follow my Twitch to see me play some Apex Live. But anyways, guys, that's it for me. Hope you enjoyed. I hope you guys enjoy the rest of this video as well, and I hope you have a great rest of your day. Peace. Oh! Clocky, that's a fucking little fella. Oh, I fucking fat fingered my Q. Okay, well, one's weak, like literally, like. Nice. Shotgun. Yeah, you're good, bro. They're rezzing on me. They're rezzing on me. They just rezzed. They're inside. Both inside healing right now. This is a jump pad on one of the doors. We're getting thirded. If you could like send me a pad. Nice. Last one, she's peeking the door. She's still inside. Can you send me a pad? Yeah. Let's get the fuck out of here. Ow! 
Daniel. Ow, bro. You're fucking me. Ow. Oh, they're getting EMP'd. I'm coming up behind them. Oh. Like, bro, I have kids watching me. Cat. Cat. Like, you know, Inside here. <laughs> Sophie the dino. Nah. She needs to go. Is there anyone inside there? Sophie! Don't even know who you are. Fuck your crypto drone, you little bitch. <laughs> two, two and second floor. Uh, is the little one. Ro rocking on. Rising inside. Second floor? Yeah, second floor. Oh, Bangor had double press. No, no, no. She dropped? She like dropped down here somewhere. No, no, what the fuck? She's still there. What is going on right now? One is blue. He's 40, 40 blue. Oh, I wish I could see something, but I literally can't because it's fucking fire. This, this, this is what I'm about to do, bro. Horizon cracked. Hit 100. She's flushed. <laughs> punch her ass, punch her ass. Get her. Let's go. GG.